You know that one time you forgot to pass an argument to a Python function, and it just crashed? That's where default values save the day. Let's say we have a function that greets a user. Now if we call greet Anthony, it prints, hello, Anthony. But if we just call greet, Python uses the default. So it says, hello, guest. You can even mix default and non-default arguments like this. So power 5 gives you 25, and power 5, 3 gives 125. Here's something to remember. Default values are set only once when the function is defined. So if you use a mutable object like a list as a default, it can behave weirdly between calls. Now calling add item A, then add item B will actually give you A, B in a list, not separate lists. To fix it, use none as the default and create a new list inside the function. Try changing those defaults and see how your function reacts.